I'm not gonna lie, I don't really watch sports. That don't make me a homosexual, so shut up. Now I've said it before, sports are not really my thing, but I found this video with a half million views. It's of this hockey game where the puck flies up and into the back of the goalie's pants. Gerhoff got it ahead, now across ice to Pezik. Pezik gaining the line. He takes a shot, rebound, he shot it up in the air, it's right to go. All right, now watch it again in slow motion. Watch this, watch this. The puck's gonna drop right here. Hansel tries for it, it falls right in the back oh of his pants. Lord. And watch this. Now keep in mind that these two teams are tied in overtime, so this goal is really important. After review of the play, the puck did cross the line. We have a good goal. Now here's where it gets interesting. I was reading, because I do that sometimes, that there's a rule in hockey that as soon as the ref loses sight of the puck, he must stop the game which he didn't do. Which has got hockey fans up in arms like, oh, what's all that about? You know, now that I think about it, this feels like something that would happen in a Will Ferrell comedy movie. Something that you'd watch it and you'd laugh and then you'd go, man, that's bullshit. That would never happen in real hockey. Well, it did. Now, I found this video on a site called wimp.com site that was apparently named after you. Now, I like this video. I find it impressive. It's more of a positive video as opposed to one of someone falling on their ass. Now, this is appropriately titled, This Guy Can Really Sing a Note. Now, it's pretty simple. It's just a barbershop quartet showing off their skills. Now, pay attention to the guy over here. She's Well, well, pretty impressive indeed. The singer's name is Tim Warwick, and this note clocks in at roughly 31 seconds. Now, being the guy that I am, I'm gonna have to try this out and see how difficult it really is. How come nobody knows how to flush a toilet after they've had a Was that? 24 seconds. Yeah! That means nothing. Now, apparently these guys are an award-winning barbershop quartet from Missouri. They're called Vocal Spectrum, if you wanted to look them up. And by the way, guys, try that. Try holding that note. And, and let me know in the comments section how long you could hold that note. It's not nearly as easy as it looks. So just when I think I've seen it all, someone makes a how-to video showing how to make a rabbit pass gas. It exists. Now this video is actually from a company called Howcast. They make short form instructional videos according to their website. Give rabbits belly massage and some rabbits just really love this and respond to it and it's very helpful with gas. Sometimes you'll hear them pass gas or you'll hear the gas bubbling around in their bellies when you do this. And you can hear funny little noises like ko yo 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 when you're doing this. You hear the gas moving around and I raise his butt and I basically I let him bounce like this. Just gently let him bounce. And you don't have to wait till your bunny has gas pain to do this. I've never owned a rabbit, so I have no idea how important it is to actually help a rabbit with gas. But apparently it's a big enough problem to constitute making an entire instructional video dedicated to dealing with it. I don't even think people pay that much attention to helping a baby fart. Come on, fart. Fart, you little shit. <sighs> That's better. Now the first thought going through my head is, instead of going through this complicated massage, why not just let the rabbit pass his gas on his own? I'm just saying, I'm pretty sure bunnies have been able to pass their own gas long before human beings came along and decided to lift them in the air and literally shake the fart out of them. By the way guys, now when you go to the club and you see a girl twerking, you know what she's really trying to do. <laughs> Good thing the music's loud. All right, guys, a uh, lot, of, lot of fart jokes in this one. Sorry about that. But that's my time. Um, don't forget to check out the full videos. Links are down below in the description. I will see you guys on the podcast in a few days. And don't forget to have a happy new year. I'm Ray William Johnson, and I approve this message. Come on. 
fart, you little shit. Come on. <laughs> his, <laughs> his fucking head. <laughs> He's apparently possessed. How come nobody knows how to flush the toilet after they've had a shit? Uh, how long? Six. Damn it! It's the same! <laughs>